the homes in Bombay are not a pretty big. We wanted something which is not very flashy but a bit of classy and a bit of color which is into beige or some royal colors. When we had bought this flat, you know, we wanted something very subtle and uh, that's how we finalized this design with Bonito. I'm uh, working in a leading packaging firm here uh, as a head of our sales and marketing. And uh, we here at uh, 2BHK, it's my wife, Sarita, my daughter, she's a six year old kid. So we three are staying here. For me, my first choice was the living room should be like uh, one of the best, you know, some European buildings and then uh, some mirrors on the side so that the room looks bigger. And with my bar counter this and the corner of it, you know, I mean, that really uh, went well. That is the place where we sit around. Me, my wife, living room and the corner of the bar unit is the best thing I would say. I mean, for me, that is my personal space. The kids' bedroom, that is a room where she will be sleeping or uh, enjoying with her friends or doing some exercises or play around. So we wanted more space. That's when, you know, we were suggested that why shouldn't we go for, uh, you know, a wall-mounted bed. And this uh, sort of feedback, you know, once the moment we got, we were like instant click. Yeah, I mean, this was pretty nice. This is what we were looking for. For master bedroom again, you know, uh, we wanted a wallpaper to get through with particular lightings and stuff, not to be again very flashy. So the kind of design what I got, you know, that was really good. So my requirement with Bonito was very clear, you know, I mean, we said we wanted a bit of space, uh, not pretty congested. One of the biggest reasons why I went ahead with Bonito was, you know, the quality which was uh, shown to me, the kind of work, the kind of feedback which I have won from my probably fellow colleagues. My couple of next or third visit, you know, I was like, I mean, let's see as in uh, what sort of, you know, quality of handles were you using or probably the channel doors what you're using or the glasses what they use. So these are specific top two, top three brands from which you can choose. So I was like, wow, I mean, Bonito was using one of the top two or top three brands, which could be, you know, uh, one of the best what you can go for. Yeah, so on the detailing part, uh, there were specific things which I really liked about, you know, the kind of lighting, what I looked from Bonito. They always suggested as in, should I go ahead with this sort of light or mood lighting or probably some uh, different lighting. So when our work started, you know, in our flat, you know, I was always worried uh, what sort of, uh, you know, work is happening every day or not. Probably, obviously, I mean, I didn't have enough time to come and visit. But then, you know, the kind of updates what I used to receive uh, from Bonito, it was a, a different level altogether. So they created a WhatsApp group where, you know, I used to get pictures and what is happening. If someday something is not happening, I used to get that update as well. They have certain apps as well, you know, where they click the photographs and they send you on the mail. So this was in a weekly update. So if something which is not happening, you always had that liberty to, you know, escalate matters within Bonito. The moment you escalate, your work is done. So that's how professional Bonito is and that is one of the best options why you should choose Bonito. So Bonito, I mean, I don't think a Bonito needs a rating. The kind of quality what Bonito gives is beyond my expectations. Should I recommend Bonito? I mean, I have already recommended Bonito already twice or thrice. 